Hello friends. Say we visited some construction sites and asked the workers their monthly income to find if they are getting paid appropriately or not. 15 people said they earn rupees 6000, 8 people said they earn rupees 5500, 25 people said they earn rupees 5000 and 12 people said they earn rupees 8000. So what is the average salary? As we have seen in the earlier video, the mean of n observations is sum of n observations divided by number of observations. So from the table, we sum the salaries like 6000 plus 5500 plus 5000 plus 8000 and divide it by 4. This will give us rupees 6125 as the average salary. Is this correct average? Well, guess what? That is absolutely wrong. Why? Look closely. It is ungrouped frequency distribution means it is not grouped data and frequency of data given means that particular data is appearing again and again. 15 people said they earn 6000 rupees means there is data for 15 people that is 15 observations means 6000 would appear 15 times in the data. So sum for these people would be 15 times 6000. Same way we get 8 times 5500 that is sum of 8 observations of 5500 rupees salary. 25 times 5000 which is sum of 25 observations of 5000 salary and 12 times 8000. If we add now this value then we get the right sum of all the observations and that sum is 3,55,000 and we divide it with number of observations that is how many people were asked that number is not 4 it is 15 plus 8 plus 25 plus 12 so that is equal to 60 people so the mean is 3,55,000 divided by 60 that is equal to approximately 5920 rupees. So here we can see each term in the sum is actually product of two terms as one number repeats many times during the observation. So there is no point in writing 6015 times instead we easily got the total sum of people earning 6000 rupees by multiplying 6, 15 by 6000. So let us learn the new formula of mean for such cases. In brief, we write it as sum of Fi into Xi where i varies from 1 to 4. Here Xi is the value in observation like monthly salary and fi is the frequency of the data how many times that number appeared during observation like how many people were earning that salary for example 15 people earn 6000 rupees a month means x1 we will be 6000 and f1 will be 15 so what we did before was f1 into x1 plus f2 into x2 plus f3 into x3 plus f4 into x4. In brief, for this example, the mean that is x bar is equal to sigma fi xi divided by sigma fi where i varies from 1 to 4. So mean for this example is equal to f1 x1 into f2 x2 plus f3 x3 plus f4 x4 divided by f1 plus f2 plus f3 plus f4. In a generic way for such cases of ungrouped frequency distribution where number of observations is n the formula of mean is rewritten as sum or sigma of fi to into xi where i varies from 1 to n divided by number of observations that is sum of all the frequencies and mean is generated by x bar 
So x bar equal to sigma fi xi divided by sigma fi where i goes from 1 to n. That's all in this video. Bye-bye.